Good evening, Southeast Texas. We begin in Little Rock, Arkansas tonight. Now you're looking at the damage left behind by a massive tornado. This is drone footage showing the destruction in West Little Rock. Right now there are reports of at least one person who's been killed. More than two dozen reportedly injured. First responders ran out of ambulances this afternoon, so people uh, had to get involved. Police actually taking some of the victims to the hospital. And here's a look at the video that captured the terrifying moments when you can see the tornado on the ground there moving quickly through the northern side of the city. As Melissa Adon reports, this is part of a larger storm system that has 28 million Americans under tornado watches. Roger that. Advise me if I'm going to hit anything. Be my eyes, please. Be my eyes. Dramatic video of a tornado on the ground near Harper, Iowa tonight. Part of a tornado outbreak stretching through several states. Another reported tornado in Arkansas. The damage centered in West Little Rock, where both commercial buildings and homes have been destroyed. Cars have been flipped over, leaving down trees and power lines. I, mean, I'm, I thank God that I'm okay. People got severely injured. You can see it right there. Oh my God. The city of Little Rock urging residents to remain in their homes so emergency personnel can get to work. We had no idea that it would be this much damage that we're seeing right now. A state of emergency declared in Arkansas due to the severe weather signed by Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders. Most of you know we activated Arkansas's National Guard and we have approximately 100 guardsmen that are on the ground. Meteorologists at the ABC affiliate on the air in Little Rock reacting to the damage as they provided live reports. We have friends and family who have been affected by this, that um, homes have been destroyed. And so if there's hesitation, we're trying to keep our composure too. While damaging hail and high winds also rip through parts of Illinois, while the current storm system moves east. Everything crosses the Mississippi over the next several hours. Chicago, you're going to get slammed with this. In the early morning hours, getting through Atlanta, and then it goes into the northeast. ABC meteorologists urging people to have a safety plan in place, knowing you're near a shelter and being equipped with supplies. Melissa Don, ABC News, Los Angeles.